Hello all and welcome to another Captain Entertainment video. It's Art here with the book review for Power Shift by Damon John. Ghostwritten by Daniel Paisner. And I listened to it on Audible so I got to hear Sway Calloway read it to me with the help of Damon John. As you all well know, excuse me as I get a little bit comfortable here. As you all well know, I've read uh, The Power Broke and Rise and Grind by Damon John. Damon John is the same Damon John who created the Clothing Land Fubu and is on Shark Tank and calls himself the People's Shark. So, what is Power Shift about? The Power of Broke was about using your power of sweat equity when you didn't you have little to no money rising grind is your work ethic of rising and grinding out every minute of your work day to make your goal whether it be business or personal succeed power shift is knowing when to shift into a more affluent role um in your life whether it be personal or professional it's uh shifting on the fly to be better damon john went from being a clothing mogul to being um an investor and an investor slash money lender on shark tank and a brand builder on shark tank and every step in between. I like how he always leaves his books with uh, positive messages. Every chapter has a positive message. He is not a negative person and he is not a negative um, he does not not bring negativity or bring in negatives. He only reinforces the positives and what you do is on you, but he shows you how to be positive and to truck along and be positive and cause change and do change. He not only shows you, but he shows you in this book how he changed, how friends around him helped him change, even his uh deli store owner from down the street of where he lived in New York. So he uses all his life experiences to show you how to do it and not only how to do it, but that it is possible because he himself has done it. And he does not shy away from when he failed or faltered or had to change course because he was on the wrong course. And this does not only apply in business, but it applies in life. Because he speaks about how, how how he lost his first family and had to, um, because of him being too engrossed in the rich and famous life, lifestyle. And had to rebuild and find himself. And he is forever writing down a 10 year plan. All these things echo from the same books. As a matter of fact, I would say his <clears throat> book, his books, his multitude of books build on one another, which not a lot of self-help or business books do. Most have a one centralized idea. They pound out that centralized idea. They give examples of that centralized idea, and then they're done. He builds on each one of his aspects. And it's kind of like he's a Lego building block builder because that's how life is. He he writes these as he learns more lessons that he feels he can pass along. Because power shifting is not only about taking a, 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 advantage of what you're doing in life, but it's about taking, it's about giving back and it's about making sure whoever you're working with, be it family members or other business partners, 
get something equally as good or equitable in the goal. And if you think I'm spoiling the book, I'm not. I'm giving you the overarching bullet points that are listed at the beginning of, uh, of each chapter and each part because I am not spoiling the fact that he goes in deep depth here and the narrative he tells in this story is amazing and he backs it up with not only his examples but examples outside of his world as well. It is very well written, very well paced. I liked how the audiobook was um, not only read by Sway Calloway who I think is good for this type of book but also it's interspersed with Damon John himself giving you pointers and doing things and Damon John even set up a workbook for um, for the readers of this book to go on and put these lessons into practical use and see them written down uh, I, I, I won't give out that website because you need to go buy the book to get that website but that is that I would recommend it wholeheartedly for me it's a read it own it love it I love these books they empower me I listen to rise and grind power broke and now power shift constantly I may even go out and search his earlier books uh, the brand within and I think there's one more but I completely completely was enthralled with this book I made time to listen to this book and for me that is the mark of a good book whether it be fiction or nonfiction if it makes you stop what you would regularly do or you actively carve out time to get back to the book and get the book done that tells you how good a book is that is a mark is a mark of a good book that is what we're I'm looking for when I read a good book so for me it, it's a read it own it love it on my scale it's a five star on on the Goodreads scale I wish I could delete my brain and listen to all three of the books again but you know I can't um now now that we're done with that, and before I go into my ending spiel, you can see that I've got a new angle going on here. This angle is pretty much only for this video because uh, the current angle um, will return, or the usual angle will return. But I wanted to show this angle so that you all could see the state of my bookshelves. And yes, they are cluttered and a mess. But I'm doing this because I'm getting new bookshelves and this will allow me to give a before and an after. So that's why I'm doing this. Uh, this angle is probably only for one video, but it may appear in multiple videos once the... Uh, it may in, in, in fact be the new setup once my new bookshelves get here all nice and organized. Um, I'm going to be getting a bunch of new bookshelves. So that is that. But you know, I make videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday at 12.30 p.m. Central, 10.30 a.m. Pacific, 1.30 p.m. Eastern. Please like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more. Please ding the notification bell to be notified when I upload a video. Let me know in the comments down below what self-help or business books you liked or you liked reading that I haven't read um and also happy reading everybody stay safe save lives stay happy stay healthy have some fun happy reading i'll see you again soon and peace